tonight? We've got 40 locals booked in for dinner. It will be the most customers the bistro has ever taken. To keep things simple, I've only changed the duck and the lamb shank. Everything else on the menu is the same. Mick, I need you to talk to me. Yeah, so I know what you're doing. Right. And it's last chance saloon for Mick. If he doesn't prove that he can work as a team with Mo and Michelle, he's out. Right, talk to me, because you've gone all silent again. And I'm just trying to say really I'll do calm. What you just had, yeah, I know, but I just asked you to talk to me. Service has just started, but already Mick's not working as part of a team. Hey, look at me. I swear to God, I don't know what it is, but you, in service you disappear. You disappear. I don't get that. You don't think that? No, I fucking don't. I think you're just trying to wind me up. Mick. Hello. Everything I'm telling you, I'm trying to help you. I know you are. But you're not you're not paying attention to help. Now he's cooking dishes in the wrong order and slowing everything up. So why do you put the trout on before the steak is well done? Got to do the longest things first. Chicken will take ten times longer than the trout. That's fine. Yeah. From... Fucking hell. Mick, on that table, all yeah. you had to look after was the trout. Well, at least have the balls to admit you forgot about it. Fuck me. No, I haven't forgot about it. I just put it in the wrong oven on the wrong temperature. Mick's completely out of his depth. I have no option but to step in and do the work for him. Mick, I've just done the six tables single-handedly. But you're standing in one corner. I'm fucking making some out Running around like a blue-ass yeah. fly. Hey, Mick, I'm doing fuck all. Well, if I ain't doing nothing, I might as well not fucking Oh, you're not going to run kitchen. out again. He's absolutely fucking clueless. Can't focus on two tables at any one time. And secondly, he forgets things instantly. Puts it on, turns around, forgets it. As the night goes on, Mick's standards hit rock bottom. What's he done to my lamb shank? What's that? Uh, Cajun chicken. Yeah, Too well done. Yeah. Let's have a look. Look at that. Absolutely perfect. See if that comes back. I don't think it will. There you go. The night's nearly sauce. over, and the customers aren't happy. My salmon wasn't cooked, and now my salmon's overcooked, so a little bit disappointed. The steak we had to send back because it was cold, but when they brought it back again the second time, because it was nice and hot, but it was overcooked, unfortunately. Unfortunately, our failure is down to one person. Mick didn't communicate, cracked under pressure, and the evening has been a complete disaster. But unbelievably, he remains in denial. If that's what Mick is like with you supporting him, and me in here... I fucking don't believe what I'm hearing him. What? I really don't believe... What, what is he like when he's on his own? I don't believe what I'm fucking hearing from you. Well, talk to me, then. Am I don't fucking don't... just a cabbage standing there doing nothing? Did I call you a cabbage? That's what it's, it sounds like. Everyone else is racing around apart from me. You're making mistakes. You don't even believe you're making mistakes. There was no mistakes. Oh, it was all on. upstairs tonight, Gordon. Be honest. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, I'm really I'm fucking, fucking sorry. Fucking back Here he goes. Backing, backing, backing. Back in. You'd ever stand up. Yeah, Every mistake help. tonight's no, been up. Like... You've got to sit right. No, I will not be quiet. Babe, I'm not, I'm not having me. a go at you. I'm not having a go no, at you. No, you are. I'm just saying the mistakes tonight. You get down off your fucking eye off for right. once in your life and accept you're not Mr. Fucking Perfect. I'm...